Hello, my name is Maria and this is Mathy, my mascot. In this lesson we're going to study measuring to the nearest fourth of an inch. And here on my paper you see a ruler and then there are these whole inch marks. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Those are for the whole inches. And then there's little marks, these green and blue little marks. And these divide the whole inch into four parts. And so the first mark here would signify to us one-fourth of an inch. From zero to here would be one-fourth of an inch. And then the blue mark is actually the halfway point between zero and one inches, okay? So I marked here two-fourths, but it is also one-half. So from here to here would be one-half of an inch or two-fourths. And then this green mark is for three-fourths of an inch. Okay? So from zero all the way here would be three-fourths of an inch. And then if you have a line from zero here all the way, let's say, over here, then the line would be three and one-fourth inches long. Let's look at all that and measure some lines. I'm going to use this special ruler now to measure these lines and notice I taped here a paper that has just those one-fourth and one-half and three-fourth of an inch marks here between each whole inch, okay? In reality, this ruler has many more little lines here, but it can be confusing for children and students, so we're going to just use this for starters, okay? I'm measuring this line here. I, of course, again line this end with the zero point, and then we come to two inches and to the first mark here. So this is two and one-fourth of an inch. I can write it here. Two and then one-fourth, like that. And then inch. Or inches. This line. Okay, this is past four inches. And this would be the one-fourth mark. This is the one-half, and this is the three-fourths of an inch mark. So it is four and three-fourths of an inch. Four and three-fourths. Now let's measure a few other things I have here. Okay, now this one is not exactly anywhere on these marks. It is between this blue and this green mark, but closer to the green one. So, this green one here is for the three-fourths of an inch, right? So this is about two and three-fourths of an inch. Now this little measuring cup, I'm gonna measure here at the top, across it. Can you tell me how wide it is across? two and one-fourth inches. Now let's draw a line. Matthew, you can tell me how long of a line I'm gonna draw. Seven and a one-fourth, okay. Well, it's gonna go past my easy ruler part here. It's gonna go over here, right? So how am I gonna do that? Look at this seven and eight and all these lines here. Can you find the half inch mark here between seven and eight? It's halfway between seven and eight over here. This would be for the half inch, seven and a half inches here. And then halfway between this and seven will be the one fourth of an inch mark right there, okay? It's a little longer than the other lines around it. And then halfway between the half inch mark and eight inch mark over here, this one is for the three fourths of an inch. So this is the mark I need to draw my line up to. Let's try another one. Nine and three-fourths, okay. Again, let's look at it here. Here's nine, here's ten, here's halfway between nine and ten, and then ha halfway between the half inch and ten inch mark. Over there is nine and three-fourths, okay. Okay, we're all done with this part.